Small businesses in Santa Clara County will soon get some help in the form of $20 million. The County Board of Supervisors voting unanimously to approve that money. The relief funds are coming from the Federal American Rescue Plan. Our first Dan Thorne talked with a small business owner and a supervisor behind this proposal. He joins us now live in the newsroom with more. Dan. Well, Vicki and Grant, the small businesses, uh, the need has been great. And for places like restaurants and bars, they're also counting on customers to come back. The hope is that this funding will lend a helping hand to those businesses who continue to struggle. For almost two years, the haberdasher in San Jose has been working to stay afloat. As the fight against COVID-19 has improved, the struggles for small businesses like this remain. Whether we were shut down or not, whether there were takeout cocktails going or, or no one was buying anything, I still had to pay rent every month. Um, we kept all of our employees on, so we've pretty much gotten comfortable with uh, losing money every month. Cashborn has seen many of his customers disappear because of COVID concerns and downtown office workers going remote. But with $20 million coming to help small businesses through the American Rescue Act, life could get easier. As we know, small business is the backbone of the American economy. And the small businesses by far have been taken the hardest blow during this pandemic. Santa Clara County Supervisor Otto Lee was behind the proposal. He says the county has given out more than $700,000 in grants collected from COVID-19 violations, but much more help has been needed for the county's thousands of restaurants, bars, cafes, and gyms. Born is cautiously optimistic his two bars will be able to stay operational along with others in Santa Clara County. I can't look at this and go, yes, we're good. It's more like, well, hopefully this, some of it comes our way. And if it does, we'll do our best to, to make it last. It's still being worked out when the applications will be up on the county website. Supervisor Lee suggests when they are, businesses should apply early. I certainly want to uh, get this funds out as soon as possible for people because they're so sorely needed. Supervisor Lee says the county board is also looking into a fee waiver program to further help the struggling businesses, and the board is also hoping that the funds will become available by the end of the year. Reporting live in the newsroom, Dan Thorne, Cron 4 News. Thank you, Dan. Coming up, a big...